What's up guys, my name is Thicknumber here for Troubleshoots and today I'm going to be showing you how to get every or whatever Steam achievements you'd like for any game. This is quite a well-known method, but if you're unaware of it, this is a very simple crash course that'll probably be about 2 minutes. Head to the first link down in the description below which is github slash gib slash steam achievement manager. Go ahead and hit releases, and then where the latest release tag is, make sure to click the dot zip. Once it's done downloading, open it with the zip browser of your choice. I'll create a new folder on my desktop called SAM, which stands for Steam Achievement Manager. Select everything and drag and drop it out into the folder of your choice. You can go ahead and close the zip browser and your web browser. Now before we get into using this, I just have to warn you that I have used it myself many many times in the past and I have not had my Steam account banned, hacked, none of that nonsense. This is, as far as I know, 100% safe and trustworthy. This is what I have personally used and recommended to friends. Go ahead and simply open up sampicker.exe and you should see that it populates with all of the Steam games that are listed on your computer that are currently installed and the free ones that you've played before as far as I know. So let's go ahead and get ourselves some more achievements for Counter-Strike Global Offensive. As you can see that I have 71 of 165 achievements, which is 43%. Simply double click on the game of your choice or enter the game's ID up here. You get that by going to the Steam store, locating the game, and then copying the numbers right here where it says store.steampower.com slash app slash numbers. Paste those numbers up here and hit add game. Of course, I don't own this game, so that's how you do it for free to play games and games alike. I'm going to go ahead and double click on Counter-Strike Global Offensive, and you'll notice that I've now gone green, meaning that I'm now playing a game. And if I pull up the friends list, you can see that I am currently in-game in, in Counter-Strike Global Offensive. So let's go ahead and select some achievements. Let's give ourselves this one. Hit the checkbox next to it and hit commit changes in the top right. You'll notice a Steam achievement pop up and you'll see that if we go away and back to this, we have 72 achievements instead of 71. You can also do this in the reverse. You uncheck something, commit changes, and you won't see any pop up. But if you go away from the game and back to it, you'll see that you're now missing an achievement and it's gone gray. It's a bit confusing for Steam, but this is possible. You can also hit the lock all achievements, which removes all of them, invert all achievement, which will basically uncheck the ones that you already have and check the ones that you don't. Then you also have the unlock all achievements button, which just ticks all of the boxes. And if we hit commit changes, you can see that it stores 96 achievements. The picture has changed and we've got a bunch of pop-ups. These will continue for quite a while. We tab out of the game, tab back to it. You'll see that we've got 100% of the achievements for this game and that's it. You can go ahead and close out of this, close out of that, and you can even delete Steam Achievement Manager if you so wish. That's that. You now have the achievements. Thank you guys for watching. My name's been Tech Number here for Troubleshoots, and I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.